Hello and many blessings to everybody. I want to say good happy Friday. Good morning. Good morning. Morgan, would you like to say good morning to our guests, our viewers today? She says no. She's going over to the corner. Morgan. So today is a brand new day and I got up kind of early around 4 o'clock this morning and there she is. She's over here now. Can you see Morgan? There she is. Hey, say hi, Morgan. Say hello, darling. She says hi. Anywho, so I got up early this morning, about 4 o'clock, and I've been doing some meditating and really thinking about where my life is headed and the direction I want it to go in. And so I decided that from this day forward, I was going to start a... Live broadcast. Oh, I see Amanda has joined me. Hi, Amanda. How are you? Long time no see. I hope everything is well. Um, so, as I meditated, I thought about the things that I want to make happen and the things that are happening. I, t I said to myself, I was like, I felt inspired by watching Colette O'Neill, who is um, a wonderful woman in West of uh, Southwest Ireland who does a podcast about permaculture and how she uh, does green, guard uh, green goddess permaculture which is amazing and so watching her videos and her podcast has really inspired me to really create my own so uh, to introduce you to Morgan's Den Chicago uh, this is uh, going to be a podcast featuring Morgan, which we saw earlier. There she is. Now I'm giving you a side light look here. Her best side, I guess. Sorry if it's a little blurry. Um, so Morgan Stan's going to focus not only on just Morgan, but also the practices of Druidism, Neo-Paganism, Wicca. Um, we also are going to focus on the idealisms of how to progress as a pagan in today's culture. Um, I think that this is going to be one of the greatest teaching tools that we could really offer the new generation coming forward. Um, not only is it going to be focusing mostly on ideas, I know I'm not kidding Amanda, I'm very serious, yes. Um, myself, my, I'm Peter Rangel, most of you know me as uh, the exhibit director and artifacts handler for the Museum of Broadcast Communications. But a little bit of my personal life is that I am a neo-pagan druid. Uh, I've been practicing the magical arts now for about 20 years, um, give or take a year or two. <laughs> um, I've devoted my life to not only focusing on the positive energies of healing, love and light, um, but also on the energies of the world around us and how we can really use them to better ourselves and really put forth the energies to better the world as a place of power and a place of empowerment to draw from, um, inspiration and creativity and love and light. All these things um, continuously flow all around us. Sorry if it seems like I'm rambling. This is kind of nervous on my first video here. Um, so I'm not really focusing on me. Um, uh, this is more about Morgan and um, her story of how she is my familiar and my beautiful pet lover here. We get a little close up here of Morgan. Say hello, Morgan. You're gonna be famous. Yes, she's like, well, I'm not here for the fame. She said, I'm here for the love. And yes, we love you, Morgan. Yes, we do. So I a shot of my legs there. Say hello, Morgan, to the world. So here at Morgan's Den, um, this is Morgan's Palace. There you go, rotate the phone. I can't turn the phone while live broadcasting, it says. Yes, she's tapping on me. Yes, Morgan, hello. Morgan says hello to Amanda. So, um, here at Morgan's Den, this is a nice, beautiful little throne chair I have here. Um, here a little view. This is my couch. I tend to fall asleep there sometimes. 
Just give you a little view of what we're looking at here at Morgan's Den. Look, Morgan's tapping me again. She's like, Daddy, focus on me. It's not about the house. You're right, Morgan. It's not about the house. It's about you. And um, So here we have uh, the library. Magical uh, art supplies here. Uh, game of chess. Randy rendition. If you everyone wants to play, let me know. Library goes all the way up. Books from top to bottom. Hello, Christina. Welcome. I was just talking about uh, giving a small tour. Here's the bar of my house. We're going to move into the kitchen. This is the kitchen's quite small, but we make do here at the Morgan's Den. And there's Morgan. She's like, oh, is it treat time, Daddy? No, Morgan, it's not treat time, Daddy. That door leads out to the patio. We'll explore that a little bit later. Um, sorry if it's a little dark, I'm kind of have the mood set, if you know what I mean, as I'm drinking my coffee and kind of just doing my rounds. So that's the Morgan's Den, representation there of the wall, the gods and goddesses. That's where, this is where all the love happens here, all the, all the watching and carrying on. Thank you, Amanda. I really do try to keep it lovely, keep it cozy, the den, you know. Um... It's a picture of my mom. Hi, mom. How are you? Hope if you see this, I hope you know you are represented in my home. Um, Morgan has her little hidey cubby down here where she can uh, do her own little thing, sleep and nap. So we're gonna move along here to the hallway. This is where the main entrance is here at the Morgan's Den. Come in, kick your shoes off, put your bags down. My brother Joshua, hi Joshua, if you ever see this, I kept your drawing of a dragon who drew on a beautiful cloth for me a long time ago, put it in this frame. Um, I'd say probably maybe about 10 years ago now, if not longer, he made this for me. Um, move along here, hats, coats, this beautiful hanging I created myself for part of my Halloween costume. Um, Couple last year, I was Carnunus, Lord of the Forest. There's a beautiful wind chime. You might get a shot of me here. No, nope, no, nope. can I hide it myself in the mirror? It's not again. It's not about me. This is about my home. What we practice here, the magics that we try to infuse in our world, the potty, little duckies, collected over time. I'm gonna get too detailed here. The bathroom is kind of a mess, so we're just gonna just do a little peek. We're not gonna get too crazy. So anywho, so we're gonna move into my personal space. This is the bedroom, okay? Here we have my awards, beautiful drapery. My mother bought this for me years ago. Um, all my instruments that I play there. Here we have my altar, my practice space. And this is really what, um, the home is all about is having a place where you can practice your magics practice your energies really give forth back to the gods and goddesses and have all the tools that you need and that you could pulse sorry this is a little shaky um but all the tools you could possibly need to do magics and to do energy weaving and working um that you could possibly need or use you should always have a source of it in your home so this is my personal altar. As you can see, I have my personal spell herbs and um, doohickeys I use there. I have stones here. I have a beautiful bowl of stones here, which we use for cleansing. We have all the points represented here. North, east, south, west. The cardinal points. Here we have a representation of the male figure. It's kind of dark. Sorry if it's a little dark. And then of course we have life represented here as well. Beautiful mask here. Hello James, thank you for watching. Um, so this is my home again, folks. So here's where I have my little telly in the bedroom. This is a beautiful wind chime I made out of a touch lamp, if you can believe it. Made that myself. That's part of being a druid is being very crafty, being very knowledgeable of how, how to work with different um, objects, metals, wires. 
Uh, this is where we have my current book I'm reading right now. It's called Elemental Power by Amber Wolf. Uh, it's about um, fairy Celtic druid practices and magics. And I recommend getting it. It is amazing. Hello, Manny. Welcome. Um, so as I was saying, we're just, again, this is the first live broadcast here from uh, Morgan's Den here in Chicago. Chicago, Illinois. Again, here's the den. This is where all the magic with Morgan happens. Um, so I don't know where Morgan ran off to at the moment, but a little sip of my coffee here. I've been talking for a minute. <laughs> Um, oh, I have four viewers now. Excellent. Welcome, everybody. Welcome. Welcome to Morgan's Den, episode one. Sorry, I just had a little coffee. Um, so again, this is this is um, episode one of Morgan's Den. Um, we are talking about magical practices of Druidism, Paganism, Wicca, magic weaving, energy weaving, Hello, Michael Whitcomb. Happy birthday. I know I just missed you on the 25th on Monday, I think it was. Um, I was just actually just saying you might get a kick out of this. This is the first episode of Morgan's Den here, where we'll be talking about Druidism, Neo-Paganism, Wicca, how to do energy weaving, spell weaving, uh, energy casting, uh, writing, and learning the magics of magic world that we live in and this is going to be not about me myself this is more about my home my practice and uh miss morgan lafay wherever she ran off to let's see if we can find her again there she is there's miss morgan hiding out by the shoes doing her thing so morgan uh, we've been we've been chatting here a little bit now about um personal magical practices spaces um, your home, the things that you should have in your home, um, especially in a home, you definitely have to be able to really put forth, oh, thank you, Amanda, thank you for your blessings there. Um, in your home, you have to really be able to practice freely, feel energy that you normally wouldn't be able to feel out in the everyday world or at work or when I personally come home, I like to be comfortable, I like to feel loved, I feel cozy, I don't feel like I'm um, stressed out, I don't feel that I have to worry. There's no worry here at the Morgan's Den, it's all about love and light and success and prosperity um, for all and, each and all each and every one of us. Say hello Morgan to our viewers, hello, hello she says. Oh, looks like we're down to one viewer. She says, no, people, come back. This is a great teaching lesson, see? She agrees. It's okay, Morgan. We've been talking for a minute now. So, um, again, many blessings, everyone. Uh, this is episode one. Um, we'll be doing many more episodes to come in the future. Um, and, sorry, my hand's a little shaky. Um, so, as things progress here at the Morgan's Den, we'll be able to really put forth the energies of the world around us and teach each and every one of you how to make your home as cozy and loving and inviting and relaxing as you want it to be. Uh, all about using the energies and the magics that we each hold inside of each of us. Um, so again, many blessings from me and many blessings from Morgan. Um, we will see you all on the next episode. I uh, hope this was enlightening and hope you guys are interested and I hope that we'll see you uh, in episode two. All right? Much love everybody from the Morgan's Den uh, here in Chicago, Illinois. I just wanted to say thank you for watching and do enjoy the next episode. Bye-bye.